Welcome back. We are going to be looking in that first round of the lower bracket. Talon up against BB Team. We're looking at eliminations right now. Oh, it's, it's very much a defend Kashi for all it's worth because he is going to be a, a very susceptible to those ganks and particularly like playing against a Void Spirit. If there's one thing that this hero does really, really well, it's make those early rotations oh, and yeah. well... In trouble, yeah. you know, ends up going down. He's trying to ensure that this wave is going to stay close for Akashi, and he's going to be able to get some farm here because you cannot have a broke SF. Oh, but if he or ends up getting SF. broken, that's even worse. So they go down on the tree and then also lose the SF. Both supports are going to rotate towards mid. Makoto going to be left out on an island. He does have level six. But now with people moving in, they've got the initial jump found finish. I didn't think that was going to reach. Damn. That was getting close. Well played. No and, Oh no. Escape. Oh no. Oh god. <laughs> this is looking a lot like a oh, game I No, jeez, Ponyo, not you too. Oh Miro, get him. Oh walk him down. Man, that is really rough. I mean it's just simple math. He's got a skill with axes and it's a tree. Honestly, you still need like some form of initiation beyond just the puck. They're gonna need oh, a great no. Oh no, not like this. That was a freebie, man. Yeah, they're they're having fun. Yep, yeah, that, that much is apparent. All right, here we go. This is something. Get some of these stacks up. Oh, is he gonna get roared? Yeah, I think Ponyo's just dead now too. As they'll move in, get a little bit of help from GPK. Eight and zero. This is this is an execution. They need they need the sixes, right? Uh, uh, Supernova. Sir, he's level eight. He oh, has geez. not cast Dream Coil. Oh no. Oh god. All right. Yoakum, we're past level six, game. I'm saying the supports need level sixes. They need level sixes. Save can set up this kill pretty easily. There it is. Earth spike, done. All right, they're invading for stack number two. Makoto. Oh, he's in trouble. Oh. They get him right on the edge and roar everything used, done. Dude, that was the greatest buff line ever got. He's just going straight into the Yasha after the Mask of Madness Dragonlance. Yeah, he knows his role. Roar. Found. Pipe. Oh, he can't even get long. Bro, that one hurts. More time spent to farm up. Actually, Toronto, they weren't Tokyo. ready for the shark. Toronto, Tokyo. Okay, using abilities and dead. Miro jumped in, put the kibosh on that. Now they find Makoto. He's got to be careful. Burrow Strike goes through. There it is. Requiem out. The damage, the first kill, it's on the Aegis. Can they get anything for the second round? The second salvo. They don't have the damage that they need to take down. Miro starting to fall lower and lower. He will go down. They're on the board. Talon, can they find more? Makoto looking, hunting, wanting to take down safe. The huge or a spike. Oh, Makoto doesn't manage to dodge the damage as GPK is going to be found. He went in a bit too far. Three go down. And now if they can catch Toronto oh Tokyo also. My. Maybe an opportunity here to get back on the board. Toronto Tokyo triple kill for Akashi and Oh, Saika, not quite there with the team. Like little illusions in the back, give them an idea, and you think, oh hey, we got you know, we got the Phoenix, no egg. Mm. Easy fight, right? And then the buyback too. They decide to go on Makoto, but they have enough people there to help out. And then once you take down the Beastmaster, the second time around, everything started to look better. But you can see if they can keep this gold lead around this point for a while, maybe some stuff could work. Although now it's some trouble. That's a tree dead. Got to get out with everybody else. But Eclipse down. Roche starts to go down. It's a amplified damage so fast on Akashi. And I scan them. I wonder if they take this fight even with the Aegis. Ward did just see the Beastmaster's Courier. I mean, they, they are all still here. Everybody getting together. Jump forward, Burrow Strike. Onto that Luna right at the beginning. Down to about half HP. Now going. The Hedo, is it going to be enough? No, absolutely. Just oh, Miro's gone. But with the Beastmaster done, now maybe looking for a great X. Reaction coming out from Save, but look at him. Akashi just beating them down to death. Can they find around Tokyo? They see him just to the side. A couple more hits is always going to need the big bad Shadow Demon with the triple kill. 
into the Aegis, getting that AFK farm going and keeping the pressure on. You can see one of the lowest in the games. That less than the Lion. Yeah, and the majority of it magic damage. When that switches, it's going to be dangerous, but will it end up happening soon? Now Tree, Silence, dead. Have to back away. That's full Satanic done for the Luna. It's WS and it's Makoto. This is huge. They also have a Shieldron now on Shadowfiend. They say Miero. Uh, they roll gonna ready to jump head. just in a moment. No, he misses the burrow strike. I don't know if it's going to matter, though. They're, they're way too strong oh, right now. The Hex is out. Do they have enough to burst the Phoenix in time? Yes, they will. That's a good coil connection, but do they have enough damage from the rest of them? Zyka starts to beat into Akashi. He's in trouble. No extra help nearby at all. The Hex is there. The follow-up connection. And finally, BB blow open this lead. That is the fight that they needed. Yeah, Makoto 1v1 takes down the Beastmaster, but it's not enough. And uh, just fighting into some well-prepared vision here by Toronto Tokyo on that pillar. Oh my god, and again, the instant hex. Dude, save is on one right now. The panel talked about playing the best lion, and he's definitely showing up right now. Knew it was coming. Thank you kindly. They're going to end this game now. BB team with one great team fight. Just jump in and manage to take down Talon. What an absolute masterclass of a game from In moments in that last game, they were really calm and, and clear and, and sort of keeping their composure the entire time. We'll see if they can replicate that in this game too. As Karn is already out, Ponyo be forced to dive away. Has a fairy fire backing out. Blood Grenade is at the ready too. How much damage can they do? Tries to take him down Miro barely. Gonna walk away from that one. Uh, and then Troll Tokyo, I think, is on one of the like highest skill potential supports right now of that Tusk. Because of the addition here for Drinking Buddies, you can make new little plays like this. Oh yeah, no, it will be getting some pretty good damage there on WS with the Wrath of Nature. <laughs> it's actually enough for the kill. Yokum also in trouble. Has seven sticks, one last hit enough to bring him down. So three kills now on oh, board man. for BB team. I feel like you just can't do this right now. You can't give up your wisdom rune at seven minutes. Coming in too late, Toronto Tokyo is there. And oh, oh <laughs> Ponyo! That's right, pause on him. Oh, Zek, Zek, Zek I need to go Zek, beat, there, there's beat something wrong support. with my tusk. <laughs> Clearly my tusk is lagging. Uh, Binds, brother, you good? You good, bud? That was sick, man. Okay, but wait, he came back top. Oh, no, no, no. All right, well, WS is going to pay the price for this one. There are other ways to get XP, it turns but, out. But an opportunity, maybe an option here. Jimmy Gabe dodges the arrow. Oh, like I said, sometimes. Like <laughs> oh, man, the big wrath of nature. They got to escape from here. Th this is where things get really deadly. Save is also right on top of Ponyo. Ilka making the move. If they bring in heroes to try and keep this Phoenix alive, they might just end up losing everybody. Makoto does have some already pounded up Jingu. But Akashi goes down on the side. bottom side too. It's all falling apart for Talon. Wait a minute. Oh, I've seen this before. Wait, what hold on. What has happened? Can they deal with these like early rotations that are starting to come out? WS not quite at level six, making the move over with save, does some good damage, but there's the flame break, push back, and now Makoto trying to keep a little bit of distance, keep WS alive. Will it be enough? Yes, although he oh. dies to the bugs. Can't get the bugs off of him. It's BB team that are the ones that are causing this disharmony. They're the ones that are making this stuff so much harder. And now, WS left alone. They will throw out an arrow, but there's way too many heroes Wait, gonna all surrounding this. This is a rough one. BB team. So both teams baiting their carries. Here we go. Strength form, strength form, but have they gone too far? The torrent, it's gonna connect with the boat, but they have the supernova up on the high ground. He gets the waveform out. Look at the arena, it's already connected. So much damage on all of Bed Boom and Talon. They're not going out without a fight. Radians are scanning for enemies. Ooh. And it looks like it's gonna be Ponyo that's the one that's found. They're a little bit deep. But that's okay. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah. Uh, oh. yeah, that was so much closer than I thought. They're ready to go. Okay, well, you know, the panel discussed the, the BB test. They've made it past the lanes. That is a lot of fast damage on the Makoto here. He's in trouble. He's not past oh, this no. test. He's going down. No opportunity to get out of that one. An easy find. So this could catch him off guard a little bit. KB timings are nice. 
No come. Yeah. Gonna be found at mid. He's dead. They were all moving towards bottom on BB team, so I think that's why he walked through like that. <gasps> oh, they got him! Curse the old girl with the glide near. Oh, TP out of Kashi now! He's not gonna be able to do it quite in time. Wait for him to try and get out, and now the teleport, the flame break, but he's gonna get brought down. It was almost so sick, but in the end, they find the Morph lane. BB team, they just, they're on it. Yeah, there are no auras here. Gleipnir BKB on your 1-2, and then oh, no. Orc can potentially see him. Boundless Strike goes out, Nero already hit, doing too much damage. They have enough to survive through this. Maybe an opportunity as BKBs are wearing low, but Ponyo's already dead. Now WS steps forward, looks for it. Arena ready, connects onto both of them, finds the oh, kills Toronto Tokyo, but GPK, he's large in charge. Makoto jumps so far flat, GPK gets out just barely. Yeah, that damage amplification from Solar Flare was nuts. I can't believe it. Yokum got out as well. Hunting, and they get him. Ops forward, looks to the side, jump up. Can you chase? Can you find him? Boundless Strike is there. Where's the rest of the team? They're moving into position, but GPK is there also. There is the BKB. Got to run for now. Go back in. Yokum, going to leap to the side. Hunt, arrow, 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 arrow. Woo, GPK. Got to get out of there, buddy. They're separated. It's like herding cattle. Chasing on to the nature's prophet, and he thinks he's safe, but he is definitely not safe. There is the spear. The rodeo of Talon continues as they catch that nature's prophet. Uh, we talked about like there's no um, there's no auras because they're playing triple BKB core. You will set up here for WS rooted. Got him caught, stunned immediately. There's the supernova down. WS taking a lot of damage, gets the arena, keeps him stuck for the moment. It's only Toronto Tokyo as the BKB came out. Now got to be careful with no more Mars. The control is no longer there. They throw it out. x boat not connecting. Yokum gets the jump away. Still control onto Makoto. He doesn't have anything left. And now it's BB's team chasing and looking for all of the kills. Get out on Ponyo. Looks like they'll get out on the rest. And smoke, smoke is broken. Yokum there. Drops down wards. Full vision already out. He didn't drop a sentry though, so they didn't see the Weaver. Now seeing him, falls back onto Toronto Tokyo. Lasso onto the Mars. Do they have enough damage. Can they kill him down time? That's the Yule Scepter. He gets the arena off just barely. But that's BKB's reaction, and the buyback comes from the Tusk. They have to back out. Talon can't take this fight. It felt like maybe if the arena got off, it would be okay, but it did force out some BKBs. Whoa, 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 go, whoa, go. whoa, 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 Nelly. Life near, back away, Snowball pulling him far. Now the jump back. He made it out. I mean, the BKB came from Saika too. Yeah, but that is going to be Roche giving away now. Well, like, oh, careful. Do they realize what's happening right now? Kodo waiting, waiting. Boundless onto him. Damage out. Drinky Buddies keep some distance, and that's enough to keep him alive. I, just, I don't see a world where they kill that. Weak. Oh, and Akashi is low. He gets the root and the strength form off. Gets away. Now backing out. In more trouble. Does he have friends? Can he get out of there? No. Not going to happen. WS in behind. behind. He came through the gate. Uh, yeah, get out of there, buddy. That's not where you want to be. Oh, my God. All right, so nobody get hexed before your BKBs. All right, a lot of BKBs. There's a hex. Avoid that. Oh, and Lasso immediately interrupted by that. You will set your BKB out, and now the egg is down. Zyka's like still living through this, and they're going to retreat. So with the BKB used, it was used for Rena and Wukongs. Arrow becomes pretty important in these defenses too, but it's not looking like they're going to be able to keep this Rax alive. Tier 3 tower, rather, that's likely going down. Oh, spear back from WS and gets it onto the Kunkka. Will engage that base buff and GPK. About half HP. They spot WS for a moment and save every time. He finds them. The hex is out. Got him caught. Both done. And no buyback. Oh, it's back. It just ticked in. Oh, okay. He gets it. All right. So they will have buyback for the fight, but it again, it's so hard to make anything really work there. Kashi, they don't quite connect onto the tidal wave. Now jump forward, find him, GPK, drop it low. Do they have anything else extra? There's the Wukong's command to this down. No come is low, GPK getting chased down by that Marana. A couple more hits, he's done. 
The timing right there, absolutely perfect. Can't quite connect with a bash, but GPK going down is a ton of gold. Oh, Lincoln's popped. No, they skip right past him. From Tokyo showing Nero right in front. Now backs away on Makoto. Got to jump. Got to hide. Save still to the side. Now they see him. There's the Boundless. That's a great one to get. Oh, and he bought out for that. Wait a minute. Can they find more? You got to look for more here. Talon, they're going to try and chase. Saika for the Sakuchi jump away. Still thinking about hunting. Always getting close. Got to be careful. It's really scary, and he still has that Aegis. Okay, so they, they, they have nerves oh. of steel. Arrow. Torrent. Okay, they spotted him. It's now get the hell out of there. They're waiting for the perfect target. Oakum, leap. Getting out, getting out, spear oh, off oh, the mark. Oh, this does not look good, bud. No, there it is, the lasso. Can he get it off the last? No, he's going to go down. They just get absolutely obliterated. Two dead, that's gem down two. And they immediately just all panic it back. But if you're panicking backing there, it's already over. You will get caught. Nice lasso player there with the Agnums from save, but that pretty much ends it. There's no buyback on the Smires. KB is still available, trying to hang on to it as long as possible. The Hex is out, that's a full set of racks. They're gonna have another torrent connection if they need it. That is going to be mega creeps. If this one last melee rax goes down, they buy back on the Monkey King. He wants another double lasso. Look how <laughs> tempting this is. Dude, you just solar crest and send it in. It's so oh, annoying. There it is. Oh, the bait. Wait a minute. They're in way too far. The snowball is still keeping them alive for the moment. And there it is. The arena connects down onto both. Saika in no man's land gets stunned. They have the hits. That was unbelievable. Oh. Save. It's got to be the one that finds it. And now he's going to get his smoke broken. Oh, it's going to be found. The damage that comes out, it's a lot. Save, got to run, got to run. Roche about to respawn. Now, GPK shows himself for a moment. Manta back out, save. He's gone. Out of there. And now the arena is down. The Wukong command, it's so huge. The Bash is out as well, but they have the damage reduction. But I don't know if that's going to be enough. Saika, he drops to the combination, the Murata. It was way too much damage. They're chasing. They want Talon, Nero too. Talon, Talon, it's all coming up. Talon! Game three potentially in their sights here if they can somehow find a way to end this now. And now up onto the high ground as we're back into this game. 5,000 gold, that's all that separate them. BB team have been a part of some heartbreaks. Look at the swing that's happened now. This is their last clip. Okay, no they more. control their emotions though. I mean, There's we'll a see. buyback on Weaver. But they're just gonna drop it. They're just going for it. Akashi, he's very strong. Save needs to find the right target. Glimmer Cape walking forward. Want to find a Makoto. Second round with the lasso. It's not going to be good enough. It is not going to be good enough. Eyes on the ancient. They're taking it down as it starts to fall. The okay, there, is there. It's the through creepy. backdoor protection. It's through backdoor protection. A little more damage is all they need. They just need a bit more. Oh. Oh, damn it. <laughs> you got to be kidding me, Talon. Unbelievable! I'm not sure if they believe it quite yet. The headsets come <laughs> off and just relief pours over them. It's a game three in our very first elimination for the road to the international. We're getting on into it with our casters, Lyrical and Trent. The combo of coal people. We're not really there anymore. We got a lot of regular damage. We got blood grenades. Oh my god, and just like that, save going to go down first blood. On by Akashi. And You've got this support coddle with who just lost his circlet. Oh no. Save, what? save, you forgot your circlet. Ponyo just denied it on the ground. Oh no. <laughs> All, right. All right, they're tilted. Look uh, out. <laughs> cool your head. Cool your head. And the big one, of course, is also going to be those wisdom runes. Now the chase forward finds Toronto Tokyo onto him immediately. Has a boundless when he comes out of there. The cookie connects. And just like that, Toronto Tokyo going to drop, saving the boundless even on Makoto. Maybe they go on to mid though? Yeah, zip forward, finds Makoto. TP coming from that snap fire. Now the turn wants to hit Cookie away, backs out, stacks up, and Four. the fourth one will do it. GBK now low on mana, so can't go for the two supports, but they got what they came for. Yeah, this has been one of the big oh. strong points of this Luna. Rotating they see him. through. They it's see nighttime. him. The nighttime. Oh! <laughs> to be wary, slight lead could turn into a bigger lead as WS is just gonna drop right on to Toronto, Tokyo. There's a disruption for the moment and Akashi has already used 
Everything, as a matter of fact. GPK steps forward. They bring in Makoto, get some separation there. GPK low on mana, but already a Doom out onto the Mars. A trade of one for one as all ten heroes came to the bottom lane. They have the Blink Dagger, though, on WS, though, so it's time to uh, dial it up right now. Smokes as well, backing up GPK. Illusion, Rune. Oh, oh he wants it. In. Not quite on the mark. Wait, it's still gonna click. Ice Blast going out, they'll cook you away. And jump forward, Miro finds him with the Doom. Eclipse? Already out, do they have enough? Can they bring any of these heroes down? Trying to take him down, Disruption is out. As the Mortimer Kisses are going to land, they'll kill Miro for at Mars. <laughs> They're just all over the map, They're protecting everything. Like You would think that there would be some bigger items. Makoto, they just find him and kill him. If they want to fight now, I mean, it is GPK's BKB timing, and speaking of which, he's going to jump out. Finds Yoakum. Oh, gets get stunned. Stun. Can they turn? Looking, waiting, spear connection. Oh, he has a BKB. <laughs> he has a BKB, no. and he's no, going to no, no, use no. it to get out. But will he actually be able to escape? He's out of mana. He can't get to the low ground. There were so many ways that he could have lived, and he found the one where he what didn't. just happened? <laughs> You know what's crazy is that this Monkey King doesn't have arcane boots like near like every other corner. Oh, that's a uh, all right. That's a revenge. Yeah. Mars is looking to steal the Wisdom Rune, and unfortunately, they have already placed a ward to catch him. So WS is in no man's land and going to get punished for this one. This is a crazy play in a game where you're not losing by that much. Yeah, that's a tough one. And Yoakum, again, maybe going to be the one that gets found and punished for this. So they jump in. Find that Snapfire Max, but no way to get out of that one. Now recalling, save, brings in Miero. Hunting, calls another. Finding one. Oh, they can't quite There's get it. There's a lot there. of heroes Wait a minute, here, though. Oh, he gets it. A blast immediately. There's the disruption. Now connecting onto two. Mortimer's Kisses is out. Psycho BKB is already used. How much damage do they have? Akashi right on top of them. They get the Doom now onto the Luna as they try and bring these heroes down and kill them off. Is it quite going to be enough through the Aegis? It will. But still, Luna will die a two for three so far and might even end up losing more. Makoto turns to fight on a GPK. Miero goes in too. Now Saika onto Makoto does have the Boundless Strike. Oh, turn around hard. with the hit. And now connection. Do they have enough to spear? It managed to connect onto GPK. But they don't have enough damage left in the tank. Arena's up. No Doom Together. back yet. 30 seconds is a nice window here for them. Can they find the vision for a good arena? Oh, oh Makoto. Makoto! Right onto him, jumps down, tries to find him. That Shadow Demon in some trouble. Toronto Tokyo, he's living a long time. Not long enough. Psych off to the side. They kill off the AA. He has buyback. Can they make anything work there? Stun? There's the jump forward. The stun in the arena combination! They connect and kill. GPK has to zip away. Miro might be in some trouble as they keep their eyes on him. Oh, good blink nice. out. That glimmer help there from save. It might cost him his own life, but he gets Miro at a dodge. And that's the most important one. So Talon managed to take a solid fight there and take down the Morphling. And he still does spear into arena. Did you notice yeah, that? He yeah. didn't do arena and then spear. He had the time to do it, but this guy is so cool under pressure, he still does the you know, riskier ones. And GPK finds Makoto. Now they get the spear. Oh, we got interrupted. It takes it away. Toronto, Tokyo, nice save there for the moment. Doom already used now onto Makoto and WS. He's in trouble. A blast will get thrown, but no follow up. That's going to cost a dead Monkey King. GPK jumps forward, wants to find him. Oh, he BKBs. BKB TP out, wants to escape, and will do just that. Just putting no risk on that one, huh? Right. Now it's because like you can't just come back out here right now as talent. <laughs> I right. say that. They're literally doing that. They have no arena. They have no BKB on this Luna. But and they're just no walking doom. at him. There's no doom. That's what they feel confident about. Yokum gets away for the moment. GPK wanting to chase him. Akashi is off to the side. And yeah, I mean a, a little bit bold to make that move. Oh, the WS? Wait a minute, he's got a blink dagger. Blinks up! They don't realize he gets away! He's so sneaky. <laughs> he still has an FTP for another 20 seconds. There's no BKBs used. BKB about oh, to be Akashi. back up for Akashi. Akashi. He's nine seconds away from BKB, and it's going to be eight seconds too late as they kill him off. He's got to be careful. Eyes up. Akashi shows. Now Yokum out front and center. The Doom, it's ready. 
They got it already, and now also the Shadow Demon ulti. He's going to TP away. Does he survive through it? I'm not so sure. WS throws it down. AA Blast did manage to connect off to the side. Is it going to be enough damage? Yes, Toronto Tokyo goes down, but three already dead, and yep. more if he's managed to escape. Yeah, I mean, you BKB TP back to the found, but it doesn't matter. GPK. Still goes down. Break glass in case of emergency. GPK Storm Spirit, it's here. Uh, yeah, Toronto Tokyo more stacks than all of Talon combined. The, the big question mark has been, can they close out these games? Can they shut the door? Talon are off, they're farming, they're doing their thing, and Psyka's getting ages. Yoakum has just consistently been caught first in these fights. He gets the ward up. Saika is a little bit north from them. Tron Tokyo sees it with the gem. He gets and jumped. Jump, finding. Not a great hero to get to the start this fight. The gem up on the top. And now, A Blast, he blinks in to kill him. A is gone, but now Morphling, he's in trouble. Morphling dead. Makoto, BKB, going to use that ulti right away and TP out. And will indeed manage to escape. So they lose the Mars, the Snapfire, and the AA. And there's still, smoke, smoke. there's no Lincolns to work with here. They're going to go right over these wards. Gems. They're just giving Yoakum up. They see it. Jump forward. Going to go immediately dead. Yoakum's gone. Then they get the Doom onto the Mars. That is the fight that they needed. The buybacks already come from Yoakum, but they lose Makoto too. That's two already dead. They're going to need more buybacks if they want to win this fight. Akashi, four staff, trying to get away. Manta backs out. GPK, he's in pretty far. Saika right on top of him. Now the four staff come from Yoakum. That's the buyback. So they force out a lot of buybacks. There is a Roche respawn. The dangerous part is Doom has already used both of them. Refresher was committed for that. The 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 rough situation. They're gonna try and fight that. them after with no BKBs. No BKBs, no Doom. There's an opportunity, but can they get there Psyka in time? Blinks up. Can they get there in time? Psyka, he steps forward. Still three minutes on the Aegis. That is going to be oh, a ice blast. full set. Oh, okay. Like, any fight just feels so incredibly hard to deal with. All right, it does come up fast, though. Only 13 more seconds, so Ice Blast returns. They're jumping. Jump forward. Find him immediately. Nice Shadow Blade. Backs away. Now the turn. There's the Wukongs. Gets pulled all the way back, and, well, he's going to drop. Ice Blast is up. Second, second round. Miro's to the side. They already get the Doom onto the Monkey King, and now trying to kill him off in time. They got the Frice Bite onto GPK, but the damage doesn't feel quite enough, although it is for Miro. Wait a minute, maybe an opportunity here now. They catch Psyka, he backs out. They tagged him with the Ice Blast. He couldn't stay and fight. They actually oh. got him far enough back. Yeah, he dies in the well. Makoto will survive. You also don't have and to make that move. Maybe you don't even need the buyback to go. You can just go. So that is a dead Luna, does have buyback. AA Blast, ready if they want to make a move of it. Good blink out, great reactions. No coverage there as well from save. They needed a Boundless Strike at the same time. That would have been a nice catch onto the Morphling, but no luck. Is there back mid? I mean, Psychos is going to go in. He's there already. AA Blast connects. Now runs away, but he got what he came for. You get the connection for the moment. Now trying to chase forward. Both supports in trouble. And just like that, GBK takes him down. Makoto, he's in no man's land. No doom, no problem. They destroy the Monkey King, dead for two minutes. Hiding on the side, a Shadow Blade on the AA even. I mean, you can just go in and die and buy back everybody. It's 100 seconds, no Monkey King. Last gasp here from Talon. A smoke behind with no Monkey King to help them. Jumps forward, there's the catch. Arena is already down, trying to do what damage they can. But there is not a lot left in that tank. Yoakum hitting away, although it's all of them already gone. That's three dead on the side. Yoakum's going to be the fourth. Akasha, the last one left alive. This is going to be 1v10 if they want to take that fight. But GG is called with that. Talon are eliminated. BB, they're moving on. BB, they, they got what they needed. They got their Storm Spirit. They got their Keep of the Lights save. Breath of relief there. Oh, yeah.